Hello, hello YouTube. We are back with another video. I haven't made a video for a long time, but uh, I think now is a good time to make a video uh, with all the 1.5 changes happening, you know, um, housing system, all that stuff, you know. Today we'll be making a tree cutting tier list, you know. Which characters are the best at cutting trees and which aren't? You know, we named them uh, after the, the Minecraft because, you know, let's be honest, we're all playing Minecraft Genshin Impact Edition right now. So, uh, first, we'll start off with Zhao. Zhao, of course, is the best. His attack speed, plus you can slap Skyward Spine on him. You know, he's absolutely insane. His attacks are all sweeping attacks. So, you know, he could hit all 360 around him. Um, Palm characters are mostly the good ones. Um, I would say after Zhao, I would say probably Hu Tao. Hu Tao is probably in the Diamond Axe. Um, she has a couple of sweeping axe tiers, but her, her animation sometimes can be a little bit weird. It can be a little clunky sometimes. Um, let's see who is after her. Whole arm characters are the good ones. Zhongli is decent. You just have to make sure, like, with Zhongli, you can't just unga boonga. You actually have to like aim at the tree. Uh, Zhongling is good too. Zhongling is kind of like the same situation as Zhongli, where her attacks are more in a straight line. So you actually have to try. You actually have to try to hit the enemy. And uh, let's see, let's see, let's let's get the let's get the characters out of the way that uh, won't be able to do it. So you know the bow characters, you know wood axe. I'm sorry, Amber. I'm sorry. And then uh, let's see, uh, where's Fischl? Fischl unfortunately can't either. Gone, you can't either. Venti cannot either. And then uh, Catalyst users, kind of big big rip for Catalyst users too. Unfortunately, they cannot chop down any wood. You know, they were not meant to chop down wood. Same thing goes for Klee. But look, you know, at least Chi Chi, right? Chi Chi is actually good at cutting trees, all right? She's actually good at cutting trees. Actually good at cutting trees. So you want to know why? Her attack speed is absolutely cracked out. Her attack speed is cracked out. So, you know, it makes it easier for you to, uh, to get uh, the wood as fast as possible fast as possible um let's see who else it's it's mainly in the order of who has fast attack speed kaya i would say kaya would probably be in the probably stone or gold we'll leave him in stone for now we'll probably change him if needed um let's get the catalyst users out claymore characters or i would say razor razor's kind of in the iron i mean if you if you do pop his ult but i mean you won't really have his ult he won't really have his ult most of the time. A lot of the Claymore users are kind of like, they're kind of like gold tier. And then the sword users are kind of like, they're under the polearm users. Let's get Diona out of here too. Um, now it's based on, it's just based on attack speed. Bennett, Bennett is actually really, really decent. Bennett uh, has a decent attack speed. Same thing with Kaching. I would probably put Kaching um, ahead of him. I wouldn't put Kaching in the Diamond Axe tier because, uh, Kaching's normals can be a little weird because at the end, you know, um, she does a little teleport attack. So it's it's a little bit weird. It's a little bit weird to work with her. Albedo. Albedo. Albedo will probably be at the end of the Iron Axe tier because um, the, the thing is like his he's a sword user, but his attacks are a little bit slower. Same thing with Jean. Their attack speeds are kind of similar. I would put Jean uh, ahead of Albedo because, you know, you would want to uh, run around with a good looking character. But, I mean, the tier list could change, you know, depending if you like waifus or husbandos. But, you know, I like to look at good assets while I'm playing the game. Noel. Noel and Razor, yeah. They're, they're Claymore users. Zingcho. Zingcho is decent. Zingcho is kind of like Albedo attack speed. Uh, Deluke. Deluke. Deluke is in that tier. I mean, actually, I would probably put him... I would probably put him a little bit higher up since you can do attack cancels and stuff. Beto, probably closer to the end. Chong Yun, Chong Yun, Chong Yun, Chong Yun. Actually decent. I would, I would probably put Chong Yun. I would put Chong Yun at the top because if you are cutting bamboo, Chong Yun can help you. Chong Yun can help you because uh, the reason why is if if you're cutting bamboo, all the bamboo is clustered up together. If you use Chong Yun E with his talent that increases attack speed. That can benefit you. That can benefit you. But unfortunately, um, yeah, Kaya, Kaya, even though he's a sword user, he's all the way down there. 
Is there a way I can add, um, if, uh, Rosaria's not on this list, but I would put Rosaria, um, at the top of the Iron Axe tier. I would put Rosaria at the top of the Iron Axe tier. I wouldn't put it in the Diamond Axe tier unless, um, it's with caveats. You need to have, uh, Skyward Spine. You need to have Skyward uh, Spine for, uh, Rosaria, because her attack speed normally is not the best. You know, there's sword users like Kaching or whatever that, um, you know, attack faster. This is Kaching's a little bit more, a little bit more weird. It's more, um, I would say it's more inconvenient, more inconvenient. But, um, uh, definitely Zhao is the best by far, by far, hands down. Not only does he provide animo, so you can run double animo and run around the map faster. His E's allow you to get to trees faster. And, um, uh, you know, his attacks are just all sweeps, you know. Um, Hu Tao's attacks are all sweeps. Um... Zhongli and Zhongling, they they have they have very fast attacks, but it's just um you have to pay attention to with uh with them. And then uh Chi Chi, very, very, very fast attack speed. Her attacks are just very, very simple and very, very normal. You know, it's easy, it's easy to control. Um I would put Kaching up here, but the thing is Kaching's like the last hit of her attack string it makes you like do a little teleport and it could, you know, mess you up a little bit. But other than that, I mean, that's that's the whole tier list. I mean, these characters obviously at the bottom, they they obviously can't farm wood, so, you know, you wouldn't even use them. You wouldn't even use them at all. But, uh, yeah, this is my tier list for uh, tree chopping, you know. Hopefully, this tier list does indeed help you guys, you know, decide who you want to run for your, uh, your main, your main, um, wood collector. You know, it's important that we get all this wood fast because, let's be honest, nobody wants to sit there and, you know, farm wood for, like, 20,000 years. Um, but, you know, it's good that we get it fast. That way we can uh, get into the crafting system faster, you know. Maybe I might make uh, another video and a guide of more to find, you know, where the important trees are at. Like the the Kulha, which is the, the one with the Sunsetia. Maybe, you know, we can make some routes like that. But, um... On that note, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, you know, give the video a like, you know, subscribe to the channel, uh, check out the Discord, all that stuff.